Hello, hi, how are you? Are you okay? Good. Today is a science lesson and we must speak English for this lesson. Okay? Okay, let's go. Okay, we are learning about animals today. We will continue about animals. So, first of all, can you tell me what is it? What is this animal? Okay, number one. What is it? This animal, it is a squirrel. Okay, this is a squirrel. It is a squirrel. Okay, you can say it is a squirrel. Next one. What is it? Okay, any idea what this animal is? Mm, it's green. It lives in the water. It is a frog. Okay, it is a frog. Number three. What is it? Ah, uh, this is easy. It is a fish. It is a fish. Okay, number four. What is it? Very easy. This animal. It is a snake. Okay, it is a snake. Okay, number five. What is it? Okay, what is this? It is a... Okay, it is an owl. Okay, an owl. And the next one. What is it? Hmm, it is small. And... It is a snail. It is a snail. Okay, this animal is called a snail. The next one, what is it? What about this? Easy. It is a rabbit. It is a rabbit. Okay, it's very cute. And the last one, what is it? Hmm, what is this? It's not a dog. No, no, no. This is not a dog. It is a fox. Okay? It is a fox. Alright, so those are our animals today. Okay, and we want to learn more about them. So, we want to learn about some parts of an animal. Because animals have different parts to humans. Okay? The body parts of an animal. Okay, so we have this animal and this is an owl okay it is an owl and it has different parts than a human okay do you know what they are let's see so an owl has a head like a human has a head okay this is the head of the owl okay an owl has a head right here and an owl has feathers okay these things here are feathers, okay? And they help the owl to fly. Many birds have feathers, okay? And they can fly. Also, an owl has like a nose. It is called a beak. An owl and an eagle and many birds have a beak right here. And it's like the nose of the bird, okay? And the last one, an owl has talons, okay, very sharp to catch its food. An owl has talons right here, okay. Can you remember them? So we have head, we have feathers, we have a beak, and we have talons, okay, so... What were they again? What does the owl have? The owl has a head. The owl has feathers. The owl has a beak. And the owl has talons. Okay? Good. Let's change the animal. What about this? What animal is this? This is a fox. Okay? And a fox has different parts too okay can you tell me some
What are the body parts of a fox? Okay, let's start with this one. A fox has whiskers, okay? Whiskers, no, whiskers. Okay, like a cat, a fox has whiskers. And a fox has paws, okay? They are like the fox's feet. We can call them paws. A fox has paws. And a fox has fur. This is the hair of the fox. Fur, okay? A fox has like orange fur. And the last one. A fox has a tail. This is the tail, okay? A fox has a tail. Can you remember them? Whiskers, paws, fur, and a tail. Okay, let's see. So, we have the whiskers, okay? We have the paws, we have fur, and we have a tail, okay? Many animals have a tail, okay? Like an elephant or a monkey, a dog, they have a tail. Okay, good. Let's move on. Some knowledge, okay? And we want to know. We have the animals. We have a fox. We have a squirrel. We have a frog. An owl. A fish. A snake. A snail. A rabbit, okay? We need to remember these animals. There are eight animals. And we want to know... Where do they live? Okay, so where do they live? So they can live in a garden. They can live in a field. They can live in a pond. Or they can live in a tree. Okay? Four places where some of these animals can live. So let's see. Okay, we have the eight animals, a squirrel, a fish, a rabbit, a snail, a snake, a frog, an owl, a fox. Hmm. And we have a garden. What lives in a garden? Can you tell me what animal lives in a garden? Hmm. I think a snail lives in a garden. A snake? Maybe. A frog or a rabbit? Okay, maybe. A fish? No. A squirrel? Not so much. Okay. So what animals live in a garden? Okay, we can say. Okay, next one. What animals live in a field? What lives in a field? Hmm... A snake lives in a field. A frog, okay. Mm, a fox lives in a field. And a rabbit lives in a field. Okay, these animals can live in a field. Next, what animals live in a pond? In the water, in a pond. Mm, a fish can live in a pond. <laughs> And a frog can live in a pond. And maybe a snake or a snail can live in a pond sometimes. Okay. And we have one more. What animals live in a tree? What lives in a tree? Hmm. What do you think? In a tree? Hmm. A squirrel lives in a tree. A snake can live in a tree. An owl can live in a tree. Okay. What about a fish? No, a fish cannot live in a tree. Okay, so we have a snake, an owl, and a squirrel that live in a tree. Okay, good. Okay, that is the end of the lesson today. Thank you for coming and see you next time. Bye bye, have a nice day.